Hi, it's Steve from Part Select. You decided to change the ice maker in your fridge? You're not sure if you can do it or not? Sure you can, it's pretty easy. All we're gonna need, a quarter inch nut driver, maybe a pair of needle nose pliers, and maybe a flat blade screwdriver. Let me show you how it's done. The very first step we need to do before we begin the repair is to disconnect the power supply and to turn off the water supply to the refrigerator. Ice maker is located in the upper left hand corner. We'll move the ice bucket out of the way. There's one quarter inch hex head screw on the bottom side of the ice maker that needs to be removed. And there are two that are located above the ice maker on the left wall that just need to be loosened. Once we've loosened two top screws, we remove the bottom one and gently lift up on the ice maker. Tilt it away from the wall and pull it towards you, allowing the fill tube to move through the hole into the reservoir and exposing the wire harness connector at the back. We lift up on this tab on the wire harness. separate it. Next step we need to do is to transfer the shutoff bale from the old ice maker to install it on our new one. To do that put it in the off position which is the down position. Slide the back end of the hole and gently pull it out of the front end. Set that aside to install on the new one. Now your ice maker kit probably came with several different wire harnesses. Select the one that matches the harness that is on the existing ice maker. If there isn't one, remove the harness from your old ice maker. Disconnect it. We need to remove the front of the ice maker. Just gently pull it forward. That will expose a retaining clip that holds the harness to the ice maker head. We take our flat blade screwdriver and just gently press in on that. Press the tab. Pull the harness back. It has a locating rib on this end of the harness to make sure that it goes in properly. The next step will be to install proper wire harness onto the ice maker. Make sure the locking tab is pointing out. Really snap it into place. All that in the clip and the harness is ready to connect. Next we need to put the bail on the new ice maker. Locate the long end which goes to the front. Make sure the slot is pointing down. Slide it in. Pop the back in should lock in the upright position or off position and fall freely. Next, we'll reconnect wire harness. This harness will only go one way. Make sure it's firmly connected. Now we need to locate the water fill tube through the hole in the back of the ice maker. And 
tilted up onto the mounting brackets. Quarter inch screw that we secured the bottom with. Reinstall that. The ice maker's level, we can re tighten all three screws. repair is complete. That's just how easy it was to change the ice maker in your refrigerator. Thanks for watching. Good luck with your repair.